Clenbutrol. Why people use Clenbutrol? Clen is a veterinary grade sympothomimetic bronchilidator. Say that five times. It alleviates the symptoms of an asthma attack by reducing the pressure in the airways and by widening it, which increases oxygenation. But what if you aren't suffering from asthma? Then clenbuterol acts like pure adrenaline. It pumps your heart, widens your airways, almost like you are trying to escape a threat or getting ready for a sprint. Somewhat like a fight or flight response caused by ephedrine, a once popular, now banned stimulant. Now think of your body being in this fight or flight mode all day. Your heart rate is elevated. Your basal metabolic rate is increased by up to 10%. Your aerobic capacity is improved as you can breathe better. In a calorie deficit, you will torch fat, even if you are using Clen at extremely low doses. If you are performing cardio, you will drop pounds at the rate of knots. But Clenbutrol is mainly used by athletes who are conditioned and are at a very low body fat percentage. The general consensus varies, but 15% is a good yardstick to go by. If your body fat is above 15%, then clenbutrol is not the solution. Fix your diet and exercise hard. Once your body fat is lesser than 15%, you can think of using clen to polish it. Other than the fat burning effects, clenbutrol is mildly anabolic, which means you will lose less muscle even when you're in a severe deficit. Side effects. There is a reason why most experts warn you against using clenbutrol. It is a very powerful drug, and it can cause some serious permanent side effects that you can do without. So only use clenbutrol as a last resort or if you are competing. If you are looking to drop fat for your next beach holiday, clen is not the answer. Insomnia. The first thing that a powerful stimulant does is rob you of your sleep. And it's not just a few interruptions in a night's sleep. There have been instances when athletes couldn't sleep for a minute despite using Clen first thing in the morning. If you get insomnia to the point that it becomes bothersome, reduce the dose or stop using it altogether. Tremors and jitters. You will start feeling jittery after a couple of days of starting your dose. Mild jitters are manageable and won't cause any serious problems. But if the jitters are starting to affect your daily life and behavior, then it is recommended that you taper the dose a little. Many first-time users go off Clen completely because the jitters become unmanageable. Palpitations, another very serious side effect that can ultimately lead to the condition that we mentioned at the onset of this blog post. Usually heart-related side effects are felt at higher doses. For this reason, it is very important that you start at a very low dose and slowly dial in.